my channel i'm jayla corian if you're new if you're not make sure you hit that subscribe button so you never miss an upload from your girl so you guys i am taking you along my 2024 journey of building my business building my brand and developing my companies even more so i went to target i said we have to plan this thing out like being an entrepreneur being a business owner everything is about planning so right now it is november 27th let me show you the time it is November 27th at 9.37 at night. I just got back from Target. Y'all know when I go to Target, it's not just one thing, it's multiple things, but this run was a business run. So I was sitting at my desk, really just trying to map out what 2024 is gonna look like for me. And I was printing different documents out that I'm gonna use. Um, let me just take you guys over. Harlem's getting in the bag. Harlem, where, where is the bag? Harlem. Don't be getting in my bag. Okay, let me take you guys over here really quick. So I have multiple desks in my place. That's one of my desks. I have another desk over here with the printer. I have papers everywhere. And that's because I was doing a whole lot of printing. I need everything mapped out to the T. What people don't realize is like, you think that having like a business or um, being an influencer, that is just, a team behind us and a lot of times it's really not and even when we do have a team we kind of have to make sure everything is going how it has to go so we wear many 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 hats um i am one of the influencers and entrepreneurs who kind of do everything in my business i'm even gonna lie so i wanted to show you guys what i got from target that's going to help me with my productivity we are a month and some change out from the new year so i am planning now so let's go ahead and get started. Target haul. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna just put it right up here. Let's go, let's go. Okay, so first things first is I got this big binder. You would think that, you know, because you're out of school, you don't need something like this. But the big three ring binder, I have one. This is specifically for 2024. So we have the binder. Some other things that I got are dividers and such. So I got these dividers that look like this. I got the uh, sheet protectors, just because I wanted some pages to be, I don't know, protected. So I got some of those. And then I got these cuter ones. Now these ones are gonna go in this binder. So I have an overall master foul binder because I also, in my binder, are gonna have um, contracts, uh, campaign briefs that I've had, um, any like responses that like maybe I asked you guys a poll on Instagram, I'm going to have that in here. So it's going to be kind of like my Jay LaCorian master company binder. Um, so I got a few of these like dividers and such. The next thing I got is this 2024 calendar. It's just the paper one. I wanted to actually go ahead and map out by day. Like, what is this day? What is Jayla supposed to be doing on this day? So I got a big one that can sit at my desk. Then I got a 2024 um, planner. And this one is just my actual notebook version this one is the version that's going to sit at my desk so this is the one i can write in all the ideas can go in here and i love the quotes on these because it says start each day with a grateful heart so i'm excited to dive into this and this i love target brand what brand is this this is the sugar paper i think they have really cute quotes so i got the 2024 planner we are planning for a new year the next thing i got is this a container this is a document box um, anything can go in here you know um, insurance papers birth certificate anything that's important as an adult I think that every once you become a certain age you need one of these in your place because it's just documents that you need that are important taxes stuff like that so I got one of those some more like organization. Clearly, I like the sugar paper brand. More organization. This one is a weekly 
um, one and a daily one that has 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Although my work days do go past that, like as an entrepreneur, yeah, the 7 a.m. to 7 p.m., but we could definitely try to stick with this. I typically end up some days working to 10, 11 p.m., but this is the weekly and daily note tabs. I hope this isn't too bright. Like, we're not, I'm not blinding. I feel such like a kid. I got a stapler and I don't know. I just felt like I was going back to school shopping, but I'm shopping for my business. The printer ran out of ink. So what I went to Target for was just for printer ink. Yeah, but we got other things for the business so that we are prepared for 2024 because we're not playing any games. Okay. Preparation. I forget the quote. Preparation opportunity. What is it? Child, I can't. Okay, so that's that. <laughs> I did get some other things that I couldn't help, like a candle, but I'm not going to get into that. The last thing that I really, really needed was a hole puncher so that I could hole punch into the binder of all this stuff that I have over there. And the reason why I got the pink binder is because this binder right here was a smaller version. Like the actual rings on the inside are small. And I was like, oh, I'm printing out a lot of stuff. I don't know, I don't know. So that is what I'm working on over here. Sorry if it's so bright. That's what I'm working on on the video. Make sure I got everything out. Yeah, all that other stuff is just, I got some PJs. I couldn't help myself. Okay, so all of my desks are filled with things that are supposed to make sure that 2024 goes amazing. I currently, let's put y'all down again. I currently right now am working on my educational projects that I'm releasing for 2024, which I'm super excited about. It's my passion and um, it has been a lot to get to this point. I mean, um, Black Friday this year, I did not participate in it. Just a lot of my contractors as far as website developer and like back-end system stuff didn't fall through. But the thing about it is my educational projects are not something that is like needs to be discounted. Like Black Friday is cool, but like for what I'm doing and what I'm trying to create, it's a need, you know? So it's not like I'm just offering something for a Black Friday sale or anything. No, I am really mapping out this plan you guys and i'm going to take you guys along with me um it's a lot of things i'm super excited on because i what i want y'all to know is that like right here these are all my new digital products new digital products right in my hand never been released and things take time like you think that you know you think that things just happen with a snap of the finger. It happens overnight, and it does not. It takes a lot of time, a lot of times months before projects that I'm working on even hits the internet. So um, I'm excited. Tomorrow I have a meeting. I have a business meeting. At the business meeting, it was a podcast that I had. I did. It's the Money Play podcast. This has not came out. Um, I did this over a year ago, and this is just now about to hit the internet. So it's a lot of projects that I do work on that it just takes time for it to come out. So we'll be going to that meeting tomorrow. But tonight, I want to make sure that I get all of these files and stuff into my folder. Literally everything down to my logos, my media kit. Like I said, past contracts. These are really going to be for my interns that I'm bringing going for 2024. So I am looking for interns in the Atlanta area that are interested in influencer marketing. I feel like, you know, I'm 10 years into this game. I've, I've watched the internet change a lot of times. I have a lot of knowledge. I work with a lot of brands. I have a master brand sheet. Um, with all the brands that I ever work with. So, and the dollar amount that they pay me. Um, a lot of briefs, like I said, campaign briefs. I have um, like about me, I even have a sheet of like how to respond like Jayla, how to email like Jayla. Like these are all things that have to be taught 
and um, building a team has been extremely hard. One of the hardest things that I've ever done, which entrepreneurship is hard, but then building a team, connections, relationships, teaching, that's that's a whole nother layer. I also have my brand guide. So if anybody is unsure of what my brand looks like, what the logo is, what the font is, how it needs to look, nobody is confused. I don't want nobody to be confused. Um, this is just the first layer because after this, then it will be like kind of like a procedures document of like how I do things and what way I do it with the actual instructions. So if something ever happened to me, like my team still could be able to do the things that I do and it could be passed on and I can teach it even more. So I ran it. Like I said, I ran out of ink. I ran out of ink because I have all these pieces of paper. Um, the last page, it's like yellow highlighter and the yellow ran out so it start printing blue. Yeah. So these are these dividers. I also earlier today went over the no I went all the way back to 2020 and kind of like went over numbers in my business like these are just like the little things that have to be done that I know is not like glamorous to show but it has to be done so this is us doing it doing the business stuff y'all I cannot wait till all of these binders are like built out um, I guess I'm also going to need like an internships binder with procedures and instructions and things like that. But all of this has to be built out and it has to be built out by me. <laughs> like I said, all of the things that I teach, I've done every single thing in my business. Every single thing. So I'm excited for the new release of my educational projects. those. And then I'm not going to start using my calendars, my 2024 and this, until like I write it out on a sheet of paper. I'm a write it out type of girl, so I'm not, like, I'll be in my notes and stuff sometimes, but I'm a write it out girl. I like my notebooks, which is why we're, we got to write it out. Like, it comes to your frontal lobe once it's written out. Hello. You just now taking your nap? Okay, I'm doing business stuff over here. I got, I went to Target and got binders. I got 2024 calendar to map this game plan out. The first main sheet, I'm pretty sure I could have lowered my actual logo centered but hey let's just go ahead and start so this is gonna go in the pink front one jayla corian the brand the company the business and then i have my media kit mm, i don't know if this is the way that i want this to be no i want this to go Let's put let's put the important sheets with the sheet protector. I have my brand guide and my brand guide has like brand icons. So these are like the icons that's used on my website. We have my color palette. Um, it, it definitely goes into detail more, my types of fonts. I have different versions of my logo. 
um, with like kind of different sayings. Like this one is, let's see, it says Jayla Corian Live Out Loud. That was like my little saying at some point. So I have a few different versions of that and design elements. I have like SEO and keywords that I use for my brand, um, even down to even down to emojis. Everything is thought out. Every part of the business is thought out. That's how it has to be. That's what I needed the whole country for. <laughs> I am taking all of this to my meeting tomorrow. Because I come, when I come to the meetings, I come to secure the deal. Okay? You're gonna know exactly who Jay LaCorian is and who Jay LaCorian the brand is and all her digital products and everything she's ever done. And yeah, we come to secure the deal. Oh, God. Let's see how this is flowing. Okay, got that. And again, we got the brain guy. What's going to be the next thing? Good morning, guys. This is how a baddie wakes up. You know, bonnet on, bonnet on. I have managed to already open my computer, send out a few emails to some contractors that I just finished sending emails to contractors that have not completed things that I have needed to be completed um, that are past due. And it is a frustrating experience to manage people and get a team to the finish line of execution. It is extremely hard. It is not an easy task to get multiple people on board. So when you're dealing with just yourself, it's one thing, one level of having to pull yourself up and, and do things and execute and get things done and, and launch. But then when you have other people that you're depending on, that's a whole nother ball game. So I kind of wake up, like I go to sleep because I'm like pooped, I'm tired, I'm drained, I can't work anymore. That's how late I worked last night. I worked so I could not work anymore. I go to sleep and as soon as I open my eyes, we are back thinking about the work, right Harlem? Right? We back thinking about work. Uh, it never stops. So um i was doing that this morning it is now about to be close to noon i've been up i've been up since 8 a.m so all of this was going on um from 8 to 12 and now i'm about to get in the shower i have a meeting at two o'clock i have a few more things that i want to print out i've already wrote down the different things that i need to print out to complete my binder i also have already wrote a things needed to do list we have about seven things on the list that needs to be accomplished i have not put in these yet the printer new printer ink that's what i had to run out the house last night and even go to target it's so one more section in here that i need which are my analytics the meeting that i am going to i'm basically it's a business strategy meeting but i'm basically also we're going to be talking about podcast stuff numbers and executing the podcast and what needs to happen. Oh, so those are the two things that I need to do. I need to make sure that I have my numbers in this section because it's one empty section that I haven't put the numbers down yet. And then I also wanted to, let's write this down. I also wanted to outline the stuff needed for the podcast because I can definitely get sponsors before the podcast even launches. So that's the goal. The build out of twenty my twenty twenty four podcast. So, um, dang, I ran out of room. This is number eight. Season one of podcast with guests. All of this is visually going in this binder. So when I pull up to meetings, whether we're talking about digital products, whether we are talking about my YouTube channel and those numbers, whether we're talking about a brand deal, whether we are talking about um, a campaign brief and what that looks like, whether it's one of my clients that they need to have a campaign brief for their clients or whatever they're trying to launch, 
um, any type of outline, just everything, contracts, everything's in here, y'all. So I am about to shower and we definitely, the birthday flowers, all the birthday flowers are like basically gone. I love these. Over here, it's about five, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, no, six. It's six flower vases. So what makes me happy is having six, six things of flowers over there. So we didn't up the score. It used to be just one. No, 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 baby. No, baby, to fill up my tray is six, boo. It's six, they dying. Ooh, pray for my husband when we find him. Pray for him. Your girl needs six sets of flowers, not just one. Okay, y'all, I'm about to get in the shower. Get dressed. We're going to probably put on a blazer for this meeting. This is an important meeting. And she's kind of like cutthroat and like, yeah. So, let's get in the shower. All right, guys. I'm now out of the shower. We're about to get ready. And I didn't know what I wanted to go with as far as outfit. I knew that I wanted to wear this bag. But... We changed the whole outfit around. I have these pants that I love. I was feeling in a good mood, so I put some color on, put a long sleeve top on. So this is the look. We're going to take out our flexi rods. Now let me tell you, something is always going to go wrong in business. Like in business, you just need a plan for something to go wrong. And that wrong that went wrong today is I am using the Sony ZV-1F. Um, and with this camera, the, they have an on and off button a button beside it and then the record button. Don't the hair look good? Ooh. Now with this camera, one of the buttons puts a video in slow-mo and it's no audio on it. So this is the one thing that I hate about this camera. Why would they put a button that puts the camera in slow-mo by the button that I need to record? So then you'll go back to your camera and you'll realize it's no sound and everything is slow mo up. So that is so frustrating, but we we move on. I'm packing my bag to get ready to go to my meeting, and I have a few more things that I need to print out, but I didn't put the ink cartridges in from last night. I kind of got poop. So that's what we're doing here, and I'm about to go into a little work session before I leave out, putting more papers into my binder. I basically filled out all the sections, like all my sections have items in it for me to present at my meeting. So that's what I'm doing here. Don't let nothing stop the show. Prepare for things to go wrong in business. That's my advice to you. Where you been and where you hiding? I know you're lying. Don't you try it, no. You really shouldn't play with fire. Put it out with water. But now you're drowning. There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you, but I don't want to be like you. There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you, but I don't want to be like you. Cause I could do, I could do better, I could do, I could do better.
I spend a whole lot of crying, a whole lot of trying, a whole lot of telling me I should be dying up in life. what's up guys so you guys can hear me now i'm so upset because the clips the last few clips that i recorded today were in slow-mo how did that button get pressed so you guys didn't hear anything that i said but y'all came with me throughout the day and this is just the process of things going wrong in your business and with your content it happens to the best of us so what I was saying and jumping around about is that my website mock-up is done and I'm super, super, super excited. I love it. Today was amazing. I had a really amazing meeting. I put up from the whiteboard, I took home what we worked on. It is now up on my wall. So I have them, three of them up on my wall. I've been looking at them. Um, it is three a.m. in the morning I think it's probably almost 4 a.m. now but when I first started talking to you guys when the video was in slow-mo it was I was coming over to say it was 3 a.m. um but yeah it's about to be 4 a.m. in the morning I got a little bit of sleep but then I'm back up thinking about the things that need to get done and building out the plan I really like my website homepage. um my website designer is going to be working on a second page for me and that's basically what I was building out for sure for sure so yeah this is the not so glamorous part about being in business it's the part that you have to actually put in the work so i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog this vlog is sponsored by squarespace you know they love the digital boss babes and we always work in so i'm gonna put a little clip of what my new website homepage looks like it's a few more things that have to be worked on before we're ready to go completely live squarespace is my website hosting platform and i'm just so excited about the new look we are going into jayla 3.0 squarespace does have templates that allow you to make your own website and it to be easy that's what i love about squarespace i have you know got a little website designer on my team to do the extra the extra cherry cherries on top so but what i love about squarespace is that you have the option of not having to work with the designer that is why i chose the platform over five years ago to use because when i first started i did not have a website designer okay we are at the point now where i can invest a little bit more into my business but squarespace allows you to start where you're at with your budget so you can go to squarespace.com backslash jayla for a free trial and 10 percent off your website hosting because listen within your business you have to pay for your website hosting but i like squarespace prices so i'm going to have the link in my description box Squarespace has your back. If you're ready to go on the journey, your business journey, listen, you guys, 2024, we have to lock in right now. Right now is the time. So this is the time to be building. I showed you guys my planners. I brought you guys along my day, what I'm working on. This is the last few days of November. We have a whole month just well I said a whole month like the months ain't flying out of this world we have one month into 2024 set yourself up for success all right I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video bye